Hey everybody, Kelly Mitchell here from Ritual Massage and Body Work in Roscoe. And today's video, I just wanted to quickly address um, how to work on a client with larger breast tissue. So I'm getting down with my day, my very last client who actually just left a few minutes ago. Um, she came in actually off of, she called me from Google Maps this morning and I actually, I'm happy because I had um, an availability. So I'm really happy to have fit her in. She is a truck driver, so she drives all around the country, just happened to be in the area. And, um, <clears throat> excuse me, she just has a lot of leg, lower back issues happening, um, just chronic stuff, because she's sitting all the time. So as you can imagine, <laughs> she just is uncomfortable. So um, what I wanted to do for her today is really just access low back and lower body for the most part, because we only had an hour. So <clears throat> what ended up happening is that she um, was uncomfortable. She had larger breast tissue, so um, it was uncomfortable for her to lay on her stomach. So um, what we tried doing um, is to kind of give her a, a pillow to actually set underneath her stomach here that would take some of the pressure off of um, the breast area. However, once we did that, her head was kind of in a weird position face down on the face cradle. So just to let you guys know that there are options, okay? <clears throat> Typically, you'll start a massage face down, but you don't have to be face down for most of your massage. And the answer to that was that I actually didn't work her at all face down uh, for her massage. So what I did is I actually um, started her off laying on her side, so called sideline position. So um, if you've ever had a prenatal massage or something like that, um, you've probably been inside lying at some point with some bolsters and some pillows um, propped up with you to make it more comfortable. So I probably worked on her one side, um, able to work her IT band, her glutes, her calves, her feet, a little bit of low back for about 20 minutes, flipped her to the other side. Did, all right, <laughs> gonna come back and resume that video. So <clears throat> like I said before, um, you do not have to lay face down in a massage at all. If you're not comfortable, um, your therapist should be able to adjust uh, the treatment just for you. And I knew just by looking at her like, and just, it was not gonna work, okay? So we adjusted. Um, I worked her in side lying for, I would say like 75% of the time. And then after we were done with side lying, um, I just had her on her back. So she was facing the ceiling and then we, I was able to address quads, um, a little bit of hip flexors, calves again, feet. And that was the hour session. So 60 minutes, not a lot of time, but enough time to address what she needed to, and she already felt, felt 10 times better. But just know if you're someone who has larger breast tissue, if it's uncomfortable for you to lay on your stomach, she's not the first client that I've had this happen to, by the way. So if you are larger up top, I understand there are options for you. Um, so I just wanted to make this video to let you guys know that you guys do have options. You don't have to be laying flat on your stomach. Um, if at all, if it makes you uncomfortable. So um, I hope you enjoy this video and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.